Aura community is one of the communities in Ovia Southwest local government area of Edo South Senatorial Districts and played a significant role in the protection and sustenance of Oba dynasty in the days of Oba Zolwa. Oba Zolwa, known as the conqueror, was the father of Arwa. Alani of Idwani, Olokbe of Okbe, Olowo of Owo, Eze of Abo, and Uguan of Ora. It was in the course of one of the different wars of Baozola fought that took him to Ora community, which he founded. On today's special report of historical narrative, just few minutes drive from here, you will get to the headquarters of Ovia Southwest, which is the Gobazua, and going this way is not too far from the Ovia River. We're told that Oba Ozolwa, who reigned as Oba of Benin over 500 years ago after Oba Olua founded Oa community. We're told he planted an Iroko tree. So that's where we're going to at the moment to actually check the spot where he has planted the Iroko tree. With the aid of local vigilance group in Ora community, we proceeded to the exact spot where Obazolua and his wife lived for several years. On arrival at the spot, the Iroko tree planted in a reserved form by Obazolua, known as Ogwe Dion no Ogwazolua, was no longer in existence. Secretary of Ora community, Mr. West Erabo, said some timber contractors years ago cut down the Iroko tree and those who did were made to face the consequences. The Iroko tree by 1990, a notorious uh, timber contractors came here to fed the, the tree. Uh, and that very day, which the whole community did not know, but immediately something, the Iroko fell. It gave a sign to the community. That is, there was a heavy rain, poor. And that rain did not, it's not, it, it was having a color. And rain does not have a color. It was there, the elders were shouting that, what is happening? That the rain that is falling is just very white, just like a native chalk. And that Iroko tree was, was uh, announced to Oba Abini, that is Oba Eredjawa, the, which he sent his uh, traditional rulers, chiefs, to come and carry it. The chief priest of Ora community, Matthew Moi, said despite the non-existence of the tree, the people of Ora still visit the roots during the period of drought to call for quick rainfall. When he came, he settled at Egwazolwa. He created his palace in that place. When we are expecting rain here, if we didn't see rain, they will go and serve that Iroko. Before we get home, there will be a lot of rain. Oba Ozolwa. Uloko no bae. The primary school in Oa community founded in 1955 is named after Oba Zolwa. So what class is this? I hope you are learning very fast. Yes. Despite being in existence for centuries, Ora community still lacks basic amenities such as light, while the only borehole in the community is now moribund. The market is also in a terrible shape. This was the pit dug centuries ago by Oba Ozolwa, who was the father of Oba Esige and Prince Arwa. This is just to protect the soldiers at that time. From the stories we have told you, it is obvious and a lot of persons are also convinced that there is no village or community in Edo State that does not have a lineage with the Bini Royo family. This is such a case study. From the former Oa community, which of course is now a farmland, Bestinbire, Rupertin.